hey guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to do a, something a little different a type of video that i am addicted to but i have yet to do on my own um which is the amazon favorites video so if you guys have been watching my home videos you know that i purchased my house i think i've been on year yeah i've been at two years in this house next month so i'm still decorating i still have a lot of work to do decorating a home is very expensive um but the good thing about amazon is they have a lot of inexpensive things um so today we're going to talk about my home office and my home office i use it for so many different things um i use it to um record my videos um so i have three different areas within my office that i record i record my sit down videos like this one here um, i record my entrepreneurship videos at my desk uh, where my degrees sit and then i do my hair tutorials among along this um wall just to give you know a clean a clean black background so there's so much stuff that I have to do with this office. Um, I'll do an office reveal, but I still need to get wallpaper. I still need to get a chair. Um, and it's just not how I really want it to be. Oh, and I want to put a TV in this office. Yes, I, but I spend a lot of time in this office. So it's still so much that I really, really, really need to do in order to get this space complete um, before I actually do a reveal video. But once I get there, I will show you guys. So anyway, let's get into my favorites um, for my home office. Um, so the first one that I want to talk about is my setup. And so I want to talk about this one because I'm recording this on my iPhone 11. I typically never record videos on my iPhone, but my camera is broke. It's been in the shop for three weeks now. And um, if you are a content creator, you know three weeks is a long time without a camera. But I'm actually pretty impressed with this setup that I have right now. I am actually using the newer ring light. This is not sponsored. I purchased this with my own money because for some reason, all my camera equipment is just failing on me. So I had the newer ring light and I'll put a comparison on how the lights look side by side. But I had the original one, which I paid a hundred, I think I paid like a hundred and thirty something dollars for the original one. And this one that I have right now, y'all, I got this, I got a great deal on this one. This one was only like sixty dollars. So that's like a third of the price of what I well, like between a quarter and a Something like that. It's less than what I originally, pay, originally paid for the other one. And honestly, I like this one a whole lot better. Not only do I like this one because it has like a filter around the lens, which is very um, forgiving on my eyes. Because if y'all stare at this thing for too long, you will get dizzy. I don't care what nobody says. I cannot stare into this light for a long period of time. The other thing that I like about this one for the price it is amazing like if you are trying to get a home studio whatever invest in this ring light it is amazing um it also comes with a iphone hookup so i can hook my iphone onto this thing um it comes with a remote i have yet to use this remote that it comes with but i will figure that out at some point in time and it comes with these filters, which I cannot wait to use. I can't wait to use these filters, but I'm not using this on my iPhone. I'll, I'll use this filter when my camera is out the shop. Because um, the good thing about orange filters is your melanin is going to be popping. So, and speaking of lights, um, I want to get into this light fixture that I also purchased on Amazon this light fixture i've seen this light i've seen the same light fixture up to 400 dollars, and i paid like 30 i think it was like 37 dollars for this light fixture i'm gonna have every link of everything below so you guys can um click on the links but i've paid a fraction for this light fixture um and when i say i paid a fraction it was worth every fraction that i paid for it and um that is because the light is absolutely gorgeous that light is absolutely beautiful and it does look like a 400 dollars light fixture however honey this was the hardest light to put together 
Um, I installed the light on my own. I somehow figured out how to install lights after being a homeowner, but I installed the light fixture on my own and installing it wasn't hard. The process to get it wasn't hard. It was actually putting the light itself together. If you buy this light fixture, I'm telling you it's worth $30 because you have to assemble this light fixture and it takes forever. So just keep that in mind. Um, but here is a hack that I learned after I got frustrated. I went to the Dollar Tree. I bought some electrical tape. And honestly, once I bought that electrical tape, it took me about an hour and a half to put it together. But don't, do not and do not try to put this together without electrical tape because you will be frustrated but besides that the light is absolutely beautiful um the reason why i did get this light is because i needed good lighting in this room because i do um i do lives i do um youtube and i needed really good lighting to be able to record at anytime um so in addition to this i think it has it has a dozen lights on this thing and i got 40 watt daylight bulbs the edison bulb so even if i recorded this video with my out my ring light i would have really really good lighting i got these off amazon as well and i only recommend buying these lights on amazon because they're expensive as hell at the store um but i think i got uh 12 for like 40 dollars and like two is 25 dollars at home depot so um i've also placed these in my vanity in my bathroom um because the lighting is absolutely amazing um for when you do your makeup your skin looks flawless and things like that all right so the next thing since we're still on video i will get into the next thing i purchased now this is going to me this was an investment um because i'm not i'm not really into videography but i record a lot of content for my entrepreneurship videos as well as my brand so i invested in one of these this was about 200 bucks so it was pretty to me that's pretty expensive um but i got a teleprompter and so when I'm doing my videos, I like to keep, when I'm doing my entrepreneurship videos, I like to keep them under five minutes. And I, I, I usually have a pen and paper of everything that I want to say because I want to make sure I'm as thorough as possible. But I always stutter. I always miss points. So I found that using the teleprompter really helps me get my point across in those videos. And you can actually hook this up to any tripod. This is what it looks like. And basically you use, I use my iPad and I'll leave the link below so you guys can see it a little bit better on what it does. But I strongly recommend this for anyone who produces content that is educational. Uh, because basically when you look in here, you'll see the script go across the screen and it just makes it so much easier to record content um, when you do have a teleprompter, especially like when I did my um, shipping videos, things like that, I need to be able to get it out fast and I need it to be very precise so that I don't miss any important points. So let's talk about some other things. Let's talk about my desk area. My desk area was a lot from Amazon. Um, I'm still not finished with that area. I'm not satisfied with, uh, I'm really not satisfied with overall how my office space is until it's exactly how I want it. Um, and the reason is because this chair. So I had an old office chair and the chair that I want is pretty, pretty, pretty pricey. And you know, like I said, when you're furnishing a home, you can't spend, a, you don't want to spend a whole bunch of money at one time. Um, so what I did was I got a cover for my chair and it just made it look so much better <laughs> and um, the material is amazing. I love the material and it just takes it from a plain chair to a better chair and that was like 10 bucks so you can't go 10 bucks versus a high end um, chair. You can't even go wrong with that. So the next thing I want to talk about is this foot massager y'all. Y'all, I got some achy, achy feet. And this massager makes 
sitting at my desk for hours. So relaxing, because basically all I do is rub my feet against the wood and I'm just basically getting a massage. Um, I actually moved it to do this video. Um, so I went like a day without having it and it just, I was just like, it's, I just got used to rubbing my feet against this. Um, and I found this through another Amazon favorite videos and I was like, oh, I gotta have that. This thing is so relaxing. I definitely recommend this for your home office or your regular office. So the next thing is my desk. I absolutely love my desk. I love it because it's not big, but it's not small. I love the shape of this desk. I love the fact that it is glass, so it's easy to clean. Um, this, this desk was about 100 bucks. Um, originally, I had another desk in this office, which was the Ikea hat, which was a huge fail because it only lasted a couple of months. Um, but I had this L-shaped desk, which is just so functional because I could, I can write, I can use my computer, I can do so many things at my desk. And I don't like a whole bunch of drawers and things like that on my desk because it becomes bulky, bulky. Um, but um, if you do purchase this desk, you are going to need a separate drawer to store things. So the last thing that I want to get into is this dry erase board. Um, I love this dry erase board. I found it from another YouTuber called Erin On Demand. And I was like, hmm, I need that. I need that. Because I don't, I didn't want a huge board, but I didn't want something that was, um, didn't go with my space. Honestly, it really doesn't go with my space because it's rose gold. And my office is technically supposed to be gold, black, and, um, white. So when I get the wallpaper and the chair, I guess you can see the color scheme that I'm going for. But, um, this really don't match, but I like it. It's cute. It's me. It's girly. So I got it. So that is it from my Amazon favorites. Um, like I said, I'll leave, I'll leave links below to all the products mentioned in this video. Let me know if you like this type of content because I've gotten so much stuff on Amazon, but I really wanted to cover my home office because honestly, I felt like everything in here was a great value. And if I was, you know, shopping for a home office or things for a home office, things for a studio, that is basically what these are basically essentials that i feel that i would need from my home office so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you thumbs up let me know how i look on my iphone um i'm not used to recording on my iphone so hopefully this ring light setup gave me justice um i see the shadow i don't like that but whatever we gonna have to make it do what it do until i get my camera but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching bye